Hey everyone, let's talk about the ongoing conflict in Gaza. It's 2024 and the violence has escalated dramatically, marking yet another devastating chapter in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. First off, let's look at the human cost. The civilian casualties are heartbreaking. Thousands have lost their lives and the numbers keep rising. Among those, a significant portion are children and women. Can you imagine? Young lives cut tragically short and families torn apart. Then there's the injured. Hospitals are overwhelmed with those wounded in the conflict. Critical supplies are running low and medical staff are stretched thin. The health infrastructure is crumbling under the pressure. Homes, too, have not been spared. Entire neighborhoods lie in ruins. Families who've lost everything, left to pick up the pieces amid the rubble. The destruction is widespread and relentless. Now let's shift our focus a bit. What's the USA's stand on this? Historically, the US has been a staunch ally of Israel, providing military and financial support. In this conflict, the US government continues to back Israel, citing the nation's right to defend itself. However, there's growing pressure from within the US for a more balanced approach. Calls for de-escalation and humanitarian aid are getting louder. But what about an end to this conflict? Is there any hope in sight? The situation is complex with deep-rooted grievances on both sides. Hamas, despite suffering heavy casualties, remains resilient. Their guerrilla tactics and knowledge of the terrain make them a formidable force in, and on the other side, Israel's military superiority hasn't yet translated into a decisive victory. The conflict seems to be heading towards a stalemate, much like the inconclusive 2006 war with Hezbollah. Within Israel, there's growing dissent. Many are questioning the futility of continued violence and the mounting loss of life. Protests and conscientious objectors reflect the deep divisions within Israeli society. So what will it take to end this? The international community faces the daunting task of mediating a sustainable peace process. A peace that addresses the root causes and underlying grievances of this long-standing conflict. In the end, it's about finding a way to stop the bloodshed and rebuild life. It's about hope, resilience and the human spirit. Let's keep the conversation going and push for peace. Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay informed and stay compassionate.